The Cat S22 Flip is an amazing phone all by itself for people who love to carry a flip phone that has keypads and also support for necessary apps. The Cat Flip phone has recently gained mass popularity among minimalists and people who just want to move on from big touchscreen smartphones. It even supports various QR code payment apps and banking apps as well. But here's a list of top 10 specific apps that I feel like every Cat Flip user should at least try out. F-Droid is a third-party app store that is full of free and open-source softwares. The beauty of using open-source software is that it is maintained by a community and not some selfish organization. And there are no malicious codes because the code is openly available to be scrutinized by anyone. This is absolutely a no-brainer to have an open-source app store on Android. And for Cat S22, it's F-Droid Basic which works flawlessly without using much resource. Various types of productivity or alternate apps can be found from this store that are lightweight and useful and may not be available on Play Store. With the advancement of Android operating system, many apps including music players have become excessively bloated and the layouts of the UI has been adjusted to fit in only large screen phones. Besides, not all of them can be navigated via keypad. Oxio Audio Player comes to the rescue. It is a fairly great open source music player available on F-Droid that is lightweight and can also be navigated by the keypad of Cat S22 Flip using the loudspeaker and D-pad buttons. It supports various audio files including FLAC so be sure to load up a microSD card with gigabytes of FLAC collection and this app will play them nicely. Don't get me wrong. The included Google Gallery is a fairly good app when it comes to simplicity and less memory usage. But there's one big downside. The photos can't be navigated via keypad. Well, an app named Simple Gallery Pro solves this issue. Again, it's available on F-Droid and it is a great gallery app with native keypad navigation support and various other tweaks that you can tinker with. Honestly, the camera of the S22 Flip is not great, but it is definitely a useful one. So this gallery app will help a lot in viewing and navigating through the gallery. Well, there's not much to say about this file manager than the fact that it's lightweight and can be easily navigated by keypad. You can even access the SD card storage and can easily move files and folders to and from various locations from internal memory or the external SD card. YouTube app used to be great until they updated their business model and started showing ads. And I don't mean just ads but unskippable one after another absolutely worthless stupid and annoying ads that kept popping up within videos. Anyways, using modified YouTube clients do pose a threat into losing access to your Google account. So Newpipe is one of the greatest solutions to watching YouTube without getting banned. This is an open source app which doesn't use any of the official YouTube app's codes but only streams its contents from YouTube servers without any need or option to log in to your account. I mean, I can see why too many ads can be an issue so I highly recommend using NewPy and in most of the sections of browsing this app, the keypad of Cat H22 is supported. Taking a break from the vast majority of open source apps, I would like to include Nova Launcher as an amazing launcher to try. This launcher is literally made for keypad phones and is 100% compatible with D-pad navigation on Cat S22 Flip. I am personally using Nova Launcher as my default home and I have applied Pixbit icon pack to give it those early 2000s PDA look. The only thing I wasn't happy about using my Cat Flip was the browsing scenario. Chrome was way too heavy and impossible to navigate through D-pad. I tried Brave and also Opera Mini, but sadly all of them are touch-based browsers and honestly kills the vibe of using a keypad phone. Suddenly I stumbled upon Monocle's browser, an open source browser available on F-Droid. This browser is close to being perfect and is mostly usable and scrollable through the D-pad. It even has an excellent ad blocking support and privacy features that most will find very useful. The official Reddit app, well, sucks. I have found one app that I use on my cat flip to browse Reddit without any problem and with full keypad navigation support. It is Red Reader. This app is great and one of my most favorite third-party Reddit apps. 
You can even log in using your credentials and continue taking part in your favorite subreddits. Honestly, without Reddit, I could not have found such a great community as our dumb phones. So for all of you Reddit fans watching this, get Red Reader on your cat flip. It's so simple and fluid to use. This app is perhaps absolutely worthless for someone or a lifesaver, depending upon what kind of user you are. But for me, who once had a Sony Ericsson flip phone and used to love playing Java games, this is indeed a lifesaver for old school Java gamers like me, who miss those good old days of keypad gaming. You can watch the video I made about Java gaming on Cat S22 Flip from the link in the description. This app is a godsend. This is an alternative to AirDrop on Apple devices. The only difference is you can literally use this app on Android or Windows or Mac or iPhone, which gives amazing flexibility to share photos, videos, files wirelessly to any device without worrying about cable transfer. Both the receiver and sender devices have to be on the same Wi-Fi network though. I use this app across all the phones and laptops I have. It's an open source app, so no worry about any ads or shady data collection. So that's it. These are the 10 apps that I wanted to talk about with all CAT S22 users out there. I can see that a lot of you have supported my channel within its first month of existence. This has been a huge support for the growth of my channel. However, this channel is not entirely for a particular phone or device like the CAT S22 Flip. So I will be covering few more aspects of toys and techs that influence my life and how they affect my philosophy about living. So I'll be back with more cat Eston to flip videos sometime in the future. Till then, hope you enjoy some new contents that are coming to this channel in upcoming weeks. Hope all of you have good health and good mind and may we all take control of our own lives and keep inspiring others. See you all in the next video.